Hello everybody. Um, happy Easter again for whoever celebrates Easter. So guys, I want to thank you all for your support, for your comments, for your donations, for everything. It means a lot to me. I appreciate it all. Okay, so now let's get on with this reading. Some of you guys, quite a few of you, quite a few of you <laughs> asked for a reading on Sinclair Broadcast Group. So I'm seeing the news here that they're, um, the Sinclair Broadcast Group is, is forcing its reporters to air pre-scripted segments about fake news media in an attempt to undermine the non-Sinclair station. So it's like a uh, attempt to control population to they must be getting uh, tips from Putin on how to <laughs> control you know media and the information so this is how I see it like it's an assault on democracy it's an assault on your freedoms and they're fighting with every weapon that they have and um, they're slowly trying you know to take control completely and yeah it's pretty scary actually uh, but I, I don't think that their plan will work out but we'll see let's do the reading first let's see what the okay uh, first question what's the plan something about their plan their intentions their plan why are they doing this? I mean, we all know, but let's see what the cards say. Maybe we can get some more clues or something like this. Or how they're gonna do it, or we'll see. Something about their plan. Give us some clue about what's going on there with these people. <clears throat> the four of swords they're planning they're planning this thing Putin <laughs> I think it's they're connected to Putin I've told you I think they give them advices on how to <laughs> tutorials how to control media they have got uh, they have great hopes they have great aspirations like this is like their high goals for them uh, six of swords leaving and taking action. Not really sure about the six of swords. Uh, it's like I could read this as burden, something burdening. Um, it's heavy. Okay, I'll make yeah, some more clarification card on this one. not happy about yeah so it's kind of similar they're not happy about a situation uh, they want more they, they want to yeah they have high hopes and high dreams in the star card reach for the stars the complete power grab they're taking action but they doing so they're carefully planning this so what we can find out some details is they they have carefully planned this and I think they're getting tips from Putin we have Putin here they're getting some sort of a help some sort of a there is some cooperation there I, I really think that this guy is in cahoots not just with Trump but like with the big network from these conservatives people they're trying to take over and uh, with the help of Putin I'm telling you, Putin is involved somehow in this. And they have planned, carefully planned this. They're patient. They're taking action. Now, it's like, it's a go. Let's go. Let's start. Uh, high hopes. They have big dreams. <laughs> to complete takeover of power. And it's because, all this is because they weren't happy where they were. They want everything, you see. I don't want your stinky cup. I want all of them. <laughs> and it's 
yeah, not they weren't satisfied with the with what they had. In the past, they they want more. They want more. They want more. And something is heavy on them. They. I don't know, from this four of cups and six of cups, completely dissatisfied and um, disappointed with the situation. They want, they want to move away from that. They want, they dream big. They want something else. So, at the root of their these plants is like a, this big disappointment and wanting more. Um, okay, so <laughs> Putin. Oh man. Let's see what's next. What's next for these guys? What are they? What's coming up next in the future for this guy? Will they do anything? Will they be exposed? Will they be stopped? Will they actually do some? Let's see what's next for these guys. The Sinclair group. What's next for these people? Oh man! I hope I hope they all like are shamed after everything comes out. They are shamed, shamed, shamed. So we have the hangman. They're angry about what's happening. They're fighting. See. They're fighting back the the other media and the other like people who see they're not allowing this to happen. They're fighting back and these guys are fighting back. So it's like a clench of fighting. They're fighting against each other and things are being postponed. They're way to seeing how how it's this gonna go on. But they have support, a group of friends, and they're waiting. They're waiting for the right time. This the somehow People becoming aware of their bullshit. Um, you know, it's an all in the news now. Look what they try to do. They <laughs> try to force us, you know, and to control everything. So they fight back. They fight back, but they're also fighting back. But somehow their plan is being a little bit postponed, is being a little stuck, and they're waiting for the right time. They're going to go on with this because they're in cahoots with this three of cops like the friends the like in cahoots like in the the their group their um not to see and the nine of pentacles for me and here it's like it's showing like they're waiting for the right time it's just things are just being postponed a little bit they're being delayed or they're you know but they're still going on with the plans let's see even further further in the future will they manage to do anything with this will they what's gonna happen man nowadays in my country also like this television uh, televisions is they are more like the propaganda for a party or the other they're not objective news there's have, have nothing to do with information they just everything has to do with brainwashing and influencing people into voting in one way or another it's nothing to do with real news real journalism is kind of dead in my place and I fear that it's kind of I see like in many places like this okay let's see what's in the future for these dudes these guys <clears throat> Oh, the devil, they're <laughs> Putin. They have to keep waiting, keep waiting. New horizons, secrets. 
I don't know exactly the future tells me like this they're in bed with the devil but they have to wait secrets secrets with the devil being in bed with the devil and there's this waiting waiting energy so I don't I don't think they do much they manage to do much they're just postponing their plans and they're doing things here and there they're trying their best but it's like things are being postponed and they're planning some more and they're waiting some more and they're they're working on it but like I don't see okay let's see maybe if I can find an outcome and if not then meets it means that it's like not sure yet what's gonna happen let's go even further in the future like the outcome how is these people gonna and that maybe for a longer time frame or something like this I don't know oops What's gonna happen in a long run with these people? With their plan to control and manipulate people and spread propaganda and bullshit and try to <clears throat> shut down others. Man, this is crazy. You are the fake news, you are the walking, talking fake news, and you're accusing others of being fake news, like this projection. This is one tactic that they do. Putin does it, and I think that they taught these people how to do it. So they, I'm telling you, Putin is giving these people tutorials on how to. Okay, let's see. What's the outcome for these creatures of darkness in bed with the devil? The hermit, powerful, fighting, aggression, they're working, teamwork, I don't know, I don't know what to say, there definitely this aggression, there's fighting, there's, I think it's just gonna be this antagonistic, like, they're just gonna, so they want power, but with this hermit, maybe the, their voices will be more, Let's see how we can see this. Sometimes this means like searching for the truth in a inside in a more uh, or it, it could be being hushed down, like being isolating and not in the spotlight, like keeping it for to yourself or something like this. Having to quiet it down. <laughs> uh that's how I see sometimes. I don't know what to make of this. It's. I don't see it like good or bad. They keep working. They keep trying. They're working in team. They they don't they don't give up. They they keep going at it. They keep trying. Hang on a power wanting, but they're met. They're met with resistance they're not they're not allowed to gain control power like i don't see them gaining complete power uh this is maybe like going to retreat retreat for them this is their dream what they want the power the emperor so this is their card the emperor what they want the power this is the central is like retreat somehow down retreat this is from the outside the energy is fighting they're met with resistance they're feisty they're not gonna allow these people to take control and power like they want but they're gonna keep working at things they're gonna like teamwork and working and they're gonna try to keep trying to do their thing they're not gonna stop but I don't see them like taking the power completely or they're met with resistance but I don't see them falling down like oh crushing and burning neither like I see some people or you know like with the Roseanne Barrow like with Trump like I see them defeated somehow these people I don't see them defeated I just see them keep wanting the power but they're met with aggression and with resistance and 
this yet they don't stop they keep planning and planning again maybe postponing thing then planning some more then trying again then keep working at it they don't stop but they uh, but they don't manage to take control neither so I think that's uh, they're not be able to take control because they're met with resistance people are not they're not all Trump supporters they're not all <laughs> foolish and gullible they're fighting back so I don't think there's a chance for these people to take control completely they'll try for sure they'll do everything they can to try but no they're met with the resistance uh, there may be you know the Trump supporters may be vocal and very loud and obnoxious but I think the majority of people in USA are not Trump supporters Okay, so thank you guys for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.